G'day guys, how you going? Sky Pilot here. Welcome to my channel. Uh, if you can hear some noise in the background, I do apologize, but that is the rain. You may have jumped over to this video straight from my GT Power reviews that I've done of these two cracking little four and two channel chargers from my good friends at GT Power. If you have, then you're probably expecting this review. This is the B6 Mini. This is another fabulous little GT Power device, guys. So if you're out in the field and you're having a rip around with your quads and you need a portable charger, this could be the little cracker for you. I'll run through some text and specs, put it on the scales, have a look at what it does, have a look at how you do it, and give you my opinion of it. Should be pretty good. So before we open up, let's just have a look on the side here. So a few features of this unit. Small size, large power, newly added memory mode functions, optimized operating software, high power and high performance circuits, individual voltage balancing for lithium battery packs, monitor and balancing individual cell voltages when discharging, lithium battery fast charge and storage mode, and maximum safety, cycle char cyclic charging and discharging. To name the features of this little powerhouse. Of course, if you're wondering, this is a 300 water. Looking at it in comparison, this four channel, 400 water, and the X22 channel is a 200 water. So when you look at the size of this, 300 water is fairly decent. Of course, this will charge all of your lipos and lions, etc., that you have lipo, life, lion HV, lion, nickel metal hydride, cadmium, and PV batteries. Okay, let's see what you get in the box. Excellent GT Power instruction manual. These are really comprehensive, and I do like the fact, as I've mentioned in my other videos of GT Power gear, I do like the fact that you can read the manual really well, it's not too small. As if you're a regular to my channel, you'll know I actually have to use a magnifying glass on some instruction books because they are tiny. Uh, very comprehensive. This certainly tells you all you need to know. And it's also got a nice little table of minimum uh, and maximum voltages for your different types of batteries, which is really handy. Runs through the menu functions of all the menus. Really easy to follow and also gives you a comprehensive explanation of what those menu functions do so that you can use this thing without any scratching of your head at all so good stuff that's the manual and inside of course is our little powerhouse itself as you can see guys it's really small let's put it on the scales and see what she weighs in at 96.55 grams so again I'll just run through the unit nice really well put together the QC of GT Power gear is actually fantastic GT Power if you haven't heard of them they've been around for quite a long time now they've been making RC car truck quads aeroplane chargers for a long time and they are very very good at it so as expected the quality and feel of finish is really nice. QC passed. It's got some nice rubber feet on it, so it will stop it from slipping. External peripherals, we have our DC input here, which is 10 to 26 volts on the left. And on the right, we have our output and we have our balance charging port here, which will accompany anything from a 2S to a 6S. Nice vents on three sides here to keep it nice and cool. Obviously there's no fan, it's a little bit too small. Complete with a nice plastic film over the screen there to prevent scratching and your standard four button layout. So we have menu stop on the left. We have the decrease and increase and the status buttons in the middle and the enter and start button on the right there 
yeah three and a half inches or nine centimeters by five centimeters or two inches so really compact slip that straight into your bag and off you go so what I'm going to do now I'm going to plug it up to my Dynagy 1500 4S as if I was in the field one thing I did miss was in the unboxing you actually also receive this XT60 male plug here with a couple of open ends so you can do whatever you want with this you can stick it onto your cigarette lighter of your car or whatever power supply you have out in the field that is 12 volts you can even put a another XT60 on it and plug it straight into a large capacity forest to do your charging that way so this simply plugs into your input port on the left here and that is where our power supply is going to come from I'm going to hook this up to my makeshift car as if I was out in the field and we're going to have a charge this is our vehicle our 12 volt power supply simply a matter of connecting up the correct terminals red to positive black to negative so don't worry too much about this wiring here this is simply just to connect this cable up to my simulated car which is just a car battery 12 volts black to negative and red to positive so what will happen is it will have a little beep and light up just be careful you don't cross these wires or we shall have some fireworks when it's first fired up it goes straight to the program select menu so we obviously are lightweight charge here just run through the menus you can select lie ion all your different battery types the same setup guys as the x4 x2 as your imax charger these four functions are generally the same with all of these chargers which makes it really easy you can save and load your data it does your resistance and set your programs so we're going to be doing a lipo battery here so it's simply a matter of attaching your battery and your balance port and it always starts from the lower part and works its way to the top so the negative is always down the bottom so we have a lipo selected nice and easy simply push the start button and lipo charge so we hit the positive lipo store lipo fast charge and balance charge is the one we're after it also does discharging and just straight out charging so we don't want to do a fast or a store we always like to do a balance charge so select balance charge hit the enter and let's select our amperage type which in this case it's a 1500 milliamp so 1.5 amps charging at and make sure you select 4s but don't be too concerned if you do forget to change this to 4s and say for example you had it on 3s and you go to start it battery voltage high which means we have made a mistake and it won't destroy itself which is really good so lipo balance charge let's make that for us which is really good push the start again and then long press the start does a battery check and then it asks you to confirm it again once it's tested everything is set up properly so we hit the enter button again and we are off and charging now you can just hit the positive increment and it will tell you the voltage of each cell press it again and it will tell you how much fuel is in the battery after a few moments and the cell voltage as well this battery is fairly full so in a second I expect it's going to beep at me and tell me it's fully charged and there we have it full finished alarm we hit our stop and we turn it off what a fabulous little charger to take away with you just take 
a cigarette lighter adapt to this end however you like it's up to you for your input and that is all you need to get yourself charged out in the field great little idea gt power check out the links below guys i have links to their website with all their products they've got lots of cool things to look at for your rc vehicles and rc charging accessories and also check out the stores i have below as well check out the links for where you can purchase this great little charger from as well as the other items that i have in my other reviews if you're in australia it does come direct so there's no overseas postage waiting uh, it's all locally shipped which is really cool and of course if you are overseas there's some links there for you as well 10 out of 10 this is perfect for me for when i do some hiking and i wish to take a couple of batteries but i want to do more than one fly so i can just hook it straight up to my car and charge away like i would normally do at home 300 watts is more than enough to get me charged up really quickly fabulous accessory for my kit i can tell you right now guys this is a cracker it will be living in my travel bag and i will be using it quite a lot questions comments absolutely smash that thumbs up please that'll be awesome guys much appreciated good to see you thanks very much for stopping by if you made it this far into the video you're awesome if not you're still awesome see you next time guys lots more goodies to come smash on that bell so you don't miss out and again thanks very much for stopping by see you next time guys bye for now